Hey, what's up everyone? Shane here with ROA Off-Road. We are on a Roamer adventure in Colorado, 9,500 feet at the Serendipity Ranch. Thank you so much, Bart Holen Cat. This is your ranch and you've uh, facilitated this incredible uh, weekend and adventure with all of our Roamer friends from all over the country, right? We got people from Miami, California, of course here, you guys, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. You wanna introduce yourselves and uh, Tell us a little bit about you. Go, go. Well, I guess I'm Cat Holes, or Cat. Cat. <laughs> no. cat. I'm 50! Oh, cat. cat. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I make all the design decisions here on the ranch, and he makes all of the other decisions that I'm not aware of. <laughs> With his tractor? <laughs> With his tractor. No, it's Skid Steer. Skid Steer. And, and Skid Steer, uh -huh. yeah. And this is, this is Barthold. Yes, guys, I'm Barthold. <laughs> You guys um, got a camper, an off-road camper from us. How long ago now? 2019. I think we bought your second HQ15. Second HQ15 uh -huh. ever. Ever, yes. Ever. Uh -huh. And that other one, we don't even, it doesn't even matter. <laughs> You're pretty much number one in our mind. No, <laughs> so anyway, but, and, and you've been on a bunch of adventures. We've done a bunch of adventures together. Yeah, we were counting them. Um, we started with seven. Mile Rim, yes. that was a great adventure. Yeah, Thanksgiving in a snow in Moab, that never happens. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That was really oh, yeah, that was, that was great and rough all at the same time. We did the Colorado Adventure two years ago. Yes. And we recently did Baja. Mexico. Yes, Mexico. Baja, Mexico, which was fabulous. And now we're back here. And I think the brainchild happened during Baja, Mexico. Let's go back to yeah, Colorado. Let's do it here. Yep. Yeah. Yep. And, and this, Angela, she made it happen. And this has been, we, yesterday we did uh, imaging. And mm -hmm. I think some of the people in the group had never barely even off roaded. And they were on a crazy 13,000 foot, foot mm -hmm. mountain peak. Yeah. And that, that is incredible. Nobody right? regretted their choices? Do you regret your choices? Well, anybody who did is not here anymore. Oh, no. <laughs> well, those people that rolled down there. Yeah, oh, right, 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 right. okay, okay. I think they're regretting it. The people we didn't like around the campfire? Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> no, no, no. Like everybody around. Yes, no, uh, everybody's still here. So we liked everybody around everybody's the campfire. Still here. We've been Cat. having such a fun time. You guys went out and did an adventure today. What was that? We did the Via Ferrara. And okay. Gold Mountain. And Via Varada is climbing a mountain straight up, and there are some rungs in the rock, metal rungs, and then go up and up and up. And it's some horizontal, really cool. it, you know, mm -hmm. exposed oh, things, uh -huh. and in the rain. Oh yeah, it started raining halfway up. And we are so impressed with everybody who got to go. Mm -hmm. okay. I mean, this really kind of was an adventure of a lifetime. You can come back and do it, but... Yeah, I'm not sure who's going to really make the time to come back and do it, but everybody is all welcome. I know one other couple is already making arrangements, Jojo and Bobby. Oh, really? To come back? To come yeah, back yeah, and yeah. do the Via Ferrata. <laughs> well, maybe we'll do another Roamer. Yeah, next year year absolutely. And next year. Again. And then you can do it. And I can do it. Yes. Because I didn't get to do it because no. originally they told us that we could bring a five-year-old, which is Courtney. And so we planned, we signed up Decent and Courtney, and then last minute they were like, or I guess not last minute, but they told us she could go. Yeah, she was just a bit smaller, so she gets a little bit bigger. Yeah. And then maybe you can go and Next Cynthia. Next year, Cynthia will hang out with Courtney and I'll go. Right, yes. perfect. That will yep. be fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That will be fun. So what, what, is your, what is your overall take on working with ROA and the Roamer Adventures and all of that stuff? I think we're leaving on this question, right? Yeah. Well, I, I, you know, maybe you should come to the cutoff tree, st tree stump Cam campground. I mean, the people say that it's, you know, rougher than here. It is, it is pretty extreme. It is pretty extreme. No, it has been, we've enjoyed meeting other people. There's uh, several people that we met along the way that we would go off and do camping. Sorry. Yeah. Without you. Without you. <laughs> 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 Is that possible? <laughs> Camping without a aroma? Yeah, you're out, like doing your own like adventures and I'm like. <laughs> yeah. Kind of making trips to go to Alaska. <laughs> Who are you making trips to go to Alaska with? Oh, we may, you would tell him? Mm -hmm. No, you tell him. Oh, I don't know. Maybe. You really want to know? <laughs> I'm I'm intrigued. Okay. <laughs> Derek and Janet and John and Leah. Oh. I think that was my idea. Oh. oh. You want to go to Alaska with us? You're going? Yeah. Yeah. Are you talking about in the summer? 
Yeah, I see an asthma going too. Perfect. You've been to Alaska? Have you talked about it too? Well, we'll I just want to go. Yeah. If we are not one of those, you know, she doesn't want it. Well, you know, okay. But on a serious note, I think that's the whole point of the community, right? Yeah, that's, that's the whole, whole point of, yeah. uh, of working with you, things. right? Yeah. Because you make lifelong friends and you get to do fun things like this. Yeah, and, and that's like... Instead of just buying a crappy trailer and then they don't pick up the phone anymore if you need some help. Yeah, that's not a good experience. No, that's not a good that's experience. That's what we're trying not to do. Right, right, right. No, it is more like family. We were lucky to, because we were kind of early in the Black Series when you were really promoting them. And yeah. we got to know you and Michael very well. Yeah. And um, it, it, it clicked easily. Yeah. And... Everybody that we meet along the way with these adventures, it clicks with. Yeah. Yep. So yep. it's yep. the people who are um, drawn towards the trailers that you are drawn towards. So it's like-minded people. Yeah, for sure. And uh, people who want to go off-road, but would like a little bit of guidance, but not so much micromanaged on what yeah, we're going to yeah, yeah. do. So that's fabulous. Smart. I think everybody's, they're smart people, you know. Uh, Birds of a feather flock together, right? So smart, adventurous people, or at least people seeking adventure. And right, sometimes right. it's like, how do I do it? And so that's kind of what we're trying to do is facilitate mm -hmm. an opportunity for people to get together, create friendships and have mm -hmm. fun and go on adventures. When the and other thing that, each other. The other thing that's cool about what you do, Shane, is, is you keep building and, and being creative on how you expand your business and how you make people happy. Right? That's all about, you're all about people and making people happy, in, in essence, right? No, you also run a business, but that's great that you can do both. Like, I think Alex and Susie are a great example. And, uh, that they were able to become roamers even though they didn't buy the trailer from you. Yeah. yeah that, that was just a brilliant idea. Right? And they were leading our, our I mean, adventure all, all, to get all, all, all you need is a, uh, a, a VIP card. You need a membership card, a yeah. Roamer membership card, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, and the funny thing is, I don't always feel like we're the geniuses. Right. It's usually, to me, it's we just try to listen to the community and the people. Right. And people nice. call in and say, well, I really want a video one. What do I have to do? It's like, well, I don't know. What do you What do you want to do? And they're mm -hmm. like, well, how about I pay you? And the, then I'm like, okay. I guess that works, the, right? Yeah. Well, no, yeah, that's, you know? that's brilliant, right? Yeah. It was a win-win for them. They really want to be on here, but they couldn't, for whatever reason, they couldn't buy a trailer from you, even though they wanted to, but they couldn't. Yeah. But this way, they still are a roamer and can go on these adventures. I think another example is your, your tech line. Tech line is brilliant, right? You, you text the tech line and you get answers back. Perfect. Well, you tested it yesterday. Yeah, yeah, yesterday. Yesterday, Friday night, like 6 30 or 7. Yep. No, Friday night at like 7 <laughs> p.m. at night. Right, right. We're over around the campfire, and I'm kind of like bragging about how we have this cool tech line. He, he, he was bragging, yes. <laughs> and then he's like, well, let's test it. Oh, sounds like, like him. Sounds I was like, like Bartol. Oh, shoot. I was so scared. I was like, <laughs> I was like heart is pumping. And well, you like, need to test it yourself, too. <laughs> Well, he you need to my have number. A... It's saved on my phone. He, right, he the the boss is texting you. Sure, you're going to answer no, the boss. Oh, <laughs> no, so okay. He, he's like, what's the tech line again? And, and he pulls it up and he dials in and he's like, asks an electrical question. What should my voltage be at? Da, 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 da. And within a minute, Sam had the answer and it was very precise. Perfect answer. Oh, yay. <laughs> Within six With, on Friday I, uh, night. <laughs> thank you uh, to all of those things that you pray to. And, uh... <laughs> yeah, because the majority, I mean, the people that we've met on the adventures are people who have not, uh, they invest in their campers as well. They do some modifications. They get to know them. They want to be able to go off-road and not have any problems. So they've gotten to know their campers. They know the ins and outs of camper of their campers. So they, they go off and they have their adventure and it's all about the happiness and the joy and the fun right, that right, they're right. having yep. and not the frustration. Yeah. Yep. And so you're going to yep. have people who are asking really good questions. Yeah. And if you have good tech yep. support that knows the answers, it's just part of that. Yeah. Keeping people happy. I think mm -hmm. I think that's that's uh you know what we say is uh this is the happiest place on earth. Isn't that our motto? Uh-huh. Or did we steal that from somebody? Uh -huh. <laughs> We're going to get sued. It, it, it needs to from, be your motto. From, from Disney. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> the happiest place on earth. Colorado at 9,500 feet. Well, it's Roma. pretty darn good. That should be Romerland's motto. Happiest place <laughs> on earth. Oh. Have a little, like, a little pixie dust 
before I uh-huh. I guess this gets edited out. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll edit it out. So we don't get sued by Disney. Yeah. yeah. It's probably a good idea. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No. And I think it's, you know, your family comes and Angela's, you know, the, the family of the Romer and staff, you get to know them too. And so you also That's feel cool. like yeah. when you... They love Angela too. That's Angela walking in. Now they all... Yes. And then all the dogs They're go, all very happy. Angela. They, know, they know her. And I think because you let people in, then it allows them to, to trust you. Yeah. That's yeah. true. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and no, no, I think that's, that's true. Kind of, mm-hmm. I've, I've, with the with our staff, anyways, that's one of the reasons why I joke. I, I joke, but I'm 100 percent serious about doing these adventures every month and every week at some point. Mm-hmm. And one of the reasons why I want that, not that Angela will go to everyone, but I want all of my guys to be able to come out and go on it. Yeah, and right. Then they gotcha. meet you guys. They mm-hmm. meet other people, and and when you're when you're working on a camper for somebody that you meet. Yeah, yep. then you do a good job. You do it. <laughs> yeah, right. the way you work on it, right? Mm-hmm. You don't want to start work. seeing them, especially when you're like, "Oh, the solar's not working." All of a sudden, you're like, "Oh, geez, this is terrible." You know, uh, I've worked like, on that. A uh, not good, thorough, <laughs> right? right? Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? So I'm always yeah. telling the guys, we have campers at the office that they can take out and use, but mm-hmm. I want them all to come out on the adventures too, like mm-hmm. every single one of them. Mm-hmm. Um, but that's so that's the reason why we're going to do more and more and more and more. But I, I I'm really grateful for you guys. Um, more than anything else is because really you guys have such a huge contribution to our success i feel like i'm very grateful for that um, for like the ranch but also just inviting us two years ago three years ago almost mm-hmm. when we two came out years here. Ago, yeah. two years ago you know mm-hmm. that was the first one and, and i really appreciate that so thank you so much and hopefully hopefully we'll have many 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 more adventures. Yes. We will. <laughs> we will. And we are grateful that you trusted us to come out here and say, yeah, this will be a great place and things will go well. And we, I really love it. I love sharing Colorado. Yeah. And it's great that you brought me friends to my house. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? right? And Jordan. Mm-hmm. And Jordan got to go on our adventure today. Thank you for, I am so happy you got to go. I'm super happy you got to go too. And and he told me, and oh, no, I'm fine. I'll just stay mm-hmm. here. And I'm like, and then after talking to you, I went back over there. I'm like, Jordan, it would make me happy if you went. It would make Cat happy. And, and, yeah. Yeah. Make Cat happy. And, and then and I was like, just try to pack up as much as you can in mm-hmm. the morning. So I don't have to pack it all up with Alan. And then he left and he didn't pack up anything. Oh. And I was like, he must have really wanted to go. <laughs> he and Alan put all the trailer away. Oh. Like, it's, okay. it's okay. I'm He's going to have happy. amazing footage. He'll have amazing yeah, footage. Yeah, the yeah, We were yeah. talking about it. We'll throw it in there as B-roll so people can see it. Mm-hmm. It's yes. Gonna be awesome. Yes. It's going to be awesome. Yeah. So thank you so much. Um, I, to me, at the end of the day, like life is more about, you know, people and giving back right mm-hmm. the, the people you meet the communities you create and, and giving back to people and humanity right yep, like yep. i believe that's what brings you more joy is is contribution and community and connection mm-hmm. and that's what i feel like we're trying to create here and you guys you guys you guys contribute so much and i think that's why you are really happy people i believe from my perspective <laughs> looking out, good, good. you contribute and give so much mm-hmm. to you know our community to your community and to the to the world you know mm-hmm. and i think the world is better a better place because of oh, you guys and thank you thank i'm you. grateful for that and we also have a great community to come together too yep. so yeah thank mm-hmm. you so much and uh was this a was this a review about roa or was this a review about how awesome you've been <laughs> <laughs> i'm i'm reviewing the uh, bar holding cat greatest people oh, oh thank you so much no, no, for no, 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 no. here and too many more adventures, right? Yep. yep. Sounds good. Alaska trip. Let's keep roaming. Yay. Yay. See ya.